welcome back to my kitchen. Um, I hope you guys are staying healthy, out of trouble, and uh, keeping your spirits up. Today, we're making something super easy. Um, I like to call it an upgrade on an American classic. So we're making some turkey meatloaf, um, but it's gonna be smoky chipotle turkey meatloaf, so it's got a little bit of kick to it. And then, since the oven's on, we're gonna roast some sweet potatoes. So you can have a sweet potato as a side with your uh, slice of meatloaf. So I'm using turkey for this meatloaf because I don't really like red meat. Um, you can use ground beef, you can use ground turkey. Um, if you're a vegetarian, they make those, um, what's it called, like meat substitute. Um, so it tastes just like ground meat. You can find that at the store now too. So you can even make this vegetarian if you want with the ground meat substitute. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do, because they take a little while, is uh, get the sweet potatoes ready to go and put them in the oven. There's lots of different ways to make them. Um, what I do, I'll just poke some holes in them with a fork, like this, and then wrap them up in aluminum foil and just stick them in there until the outside gets a little bit caramelized. And you can tell when they're done because you, you'll stick a fork right through and You'll get no resistance from the potato because it's all done. All right, so I've taken out my pent up rage on these sweet potatoes, poke some holes in them. Yeah, it's the dog's fault. Um, poke some holes in them, wrap them in aluminum foil, and these guys are going in the oven. So we've got all the ingredients in here ready to mix together. We've got ground turkey, um, two eggs, breadcrumbs, barbecue sauce, um, some minced onion and garlic powder, and the chipotle peppers. Um, now, it says, the recipe says for you to get chipotle peppers already chopped, but I can never find those in a can, so I just get the whole ones. Um, if you don't like a bunch of seeds with your pepper, they have seeds inside, so you have to cut, um, cut it out, scoop out some of the seeds, so you don't have a bunch of seeds in your meatloaf. Um, but other than that, the prep for this is super easy. Got everything mixed together. Now, just gotta put it in the loaf pans and bake it. Stay tuned. Uh, Carly does not like meatloaf, but I don't care. I'm gonna put some more barbecue sauce on top of this and have a slice and it's gonna be delicious. Carly, I'm not sharing with you. Are you hungry? <laughs> Sweet potatoes are almost done. I'm gonna go eat some. 